Hey everybody, I'm Joe Ostrowski. Thanks for stopping off at the website. I want to get you caught up on what we're dealing with in terms of weather this weekend. And so far what we've been dealing with are very pleasant temperatures and sunny skies outside. 74 degrees right now in Robinson, 71 degrees in Terre Haute, Linton and Casey, 73 degrees in Alney and Effingham. Mattoon's our cool spot at a cool 69 degrees. Not bad at all. We are, however, tracking potential for some of those April showers moving across the Plain States. You see them developing out there over northern Missouri, over parts of Illinois as well. We're going to be dealing with some of those showers, again, very short-lived isolated showers over the next few days. You can see them here on the Futurecast forecast. The first of them moving through overnight is part of the system that's going to be dominating our weather over the next few days. Tonight, overnight lows in the low 50s. Southwest winds 10 to 20 miles an hour, so a little breezy out tonight. Tomorrow, we again have uh, partly cloudy skies, potential for some isolated and brief showers. But not bad in terms of temperature, still warming up into the low 70s, still a little breezy as well during the day tomorrow. Cloud cover remains in the picture. But tomorrow night into early Monday morning, we cool back down to the mid 50s, nothing new there. Still some potential for isolated showers, even an isolated rumble of thunder here and there. Again, not expecting any kind of a washout by any means. Instead, we're just basically dealing with very short lived pop up showers, sort of like fireworks that are going to develop, bring a little bit of rain, bring potentially a little bit of thunder and lightning and then dissipate, clear out, and leave us sunny once more, and leave us really with spring-like pleasant temperatures that you can get out there and enjoy if you'd like to and if you get the chance to. Tonight, in terms of temperature, we're looking at around 52 degrees for our overnight low, about a 20% chance of showers, a little bit of lightning and thunder potential as well tonight, partly cloudy, again some showers there and a little bit of breeze. Tomorrow, we warm up to around 71 degrees, still 30% chance of some of those isolated showers, some lightning and some thunder as well. Nothing really to be too concerned about except to take all the necessary precautions you want to take whenever you hear a little bit of lightning or a little bit of thunder. I guess you would see the lightning, hear the thunder. Tomorrow night, we cool down to around 56 degrees, 60% chance of showers. Some of those thunderstorms in there as well. Winds out of the south, 5 to 10 miles an hour. Not too bad tomorrow night. We do have quite a bit of potential for rain over the course of the week. Uh, and again, we're not looking at anything in terms of a great washout, a great deluge. Instead, just some of those pop up showers, particularly strong chances for showers there toward the middle of the week, Wednesday into Thursday. Temperatures don't get too terribly cold. The coolest we're going to get is about 55 degrees for a daytime high on Friday and some overnight lows get a little cold there toward the end of the week. But we're still fairly mild through the course of the week. Just some potential for showers there. Things look to clear out, though, in time for next weekend. For Storm Team 10, I'm Joe Ostrowski.